talk about this deplorably racist article written by the Toronto Sun? So 23-year-old Jaden Pitter was shot and killed in Vaughan. The headline reading, man, 23, acquitted in Hamilton shooting of a boy, 7, gunned down in Vaughan. And so the headline really leads you to believe that this guy was actually guilty of the crime but got away due to some technicality. And also, the shooting of the 7-year-old boy has nothing to do with his shooting right now. Yet it is still 50% of the headline announcing that he died. And they only mention the shooting of the 7-year-old boy once in the article, and they have it right here. He had been acquitted of a shooting, and they link to another article that they had written. So why don't we take a look at that article? And as you go through that article, you'll notice that never once is Pitter mentioned in the entire article. You know what is mentioned? The fact that witnesses and police believe that the person who did the shooting was a white male in his early 20s. So when this guy was arrested and acquitted, well, no duh. Because surprisingly, he's not white. And if he was otherwise involved in the shooting, there are no sources in either of these articles to point towards that. Instead, in order to get more clicks, which congratulations, I clicked on your article, they decided to run with the most racist headline they could possibly think of. One that has nothing to do with the fact that he was gunned down, nor does it have anything to do with the fact that a seven-year-old boy was also gunned down previously. But follow if you want to see me debunk more things like this.